Oh, thank you. Hello, I'm Justin Pfeiffer, director of short films like Christmas and Cuffs. So today, I'll be teaching you how to make your very own short film. The first step to making a short film is getting your script. The script is where you write out your story, dialogue, character action, etc. The script is really where you make the foundation for your film. This is what a finished script should look like. Some programs I recommend for script writing are Celtics for Macintosh or Adobe Story. After your script is finished, it's time for step two, storyboarding. Storyboarding is the process of creating a visual representation of the shots you need to tell your story. If you're working alone or with a small crew, do not waste too much time on small details. As long as you can tell what the shots represent, stick figures are encouraged. Good storyboards give you one less thing to worry about on set. Once you have these, you can concentrate on actors' performances or other factors instead of stressing about the shots you need. This takes us to the final step of pre-production, casting. Acting can make or break your film. Good actors can make a good script great. Don't be afraid to take the time to find the right actors. You won't regret it. Hi, I'm Robbie Decker. I I'm reading for the part of Jack. <coughs> okay, here we go. The woods were a second home. I found we would spend most afternoons Climbing on um, tre trees or rocks. Next. Without, um, oh. Auditions are a very important part to finding your actors. The only true way to see if an actor will work for your character is to have them read a scene or two from the script. It's also important to have your actors audition together to see how they'll fit. Now that you're done with pre-production, the next step is production. Production is when you actually shoot your film. Don't be afraid to stray from your storyboards or even your script. There will be times when you'll have to do to location or other factors. Also remember to keep your actors and crew happy. If they're working for free, which in most cases they are, get pizza or other snacks to keep morale high. Now you move on to post-production. Post-production is when you edit, color grade, and do sound design. The programs I recommend are Final Cut Pro 10 and Adobe Premiere. Editing is a very important step. You can edit good footage into a bad film. Done. You're check this out. This part feels too long. It's important to show your film to friends and family to get criticism before exporting it. Now that you're done with your film, it's time for the final step, sharing it. Being that it's 2015, uploading your film online is the best way to reach the largest audience. Some platforms I would recommend are YouTube or Vimeo. Depending on the length of your film or internet speeds, expect some long upload time. Having viewing parties with friends and family is also a great way to show your film. Those are the six easy steps to making your very own short film. Remember that different people have different processes. And although I would recommend that you follow these steps to make your own short film, doesn't mean that it'll work for everybody. Don't be afraid to find your own style. I'm Justin Pfeiffer. Thanks for watching. Be